coronation of George the Sixth and uh, Queen Elizabeth. The, that coronation uh, actually took place in London, and uh, he went there, and he was one of the few invitees among the princes. The influence of the British was not merely political. It was also perceptible in some of the details of life within the palaces of the Maharajas. Many of the Maharajas had been carefully tutored by Englishmen selected by the British government in India. And increasingly, from the late 19th century, the young princes were sent to England to study at Oxford or Cambridge. These princes returned to India and introduced English tastes in dress, sports and cuisine into royal circles. This was also the period of great palace building by the Maharajas, who sought to emulate Western styles of architecture. Today, the Maharaja of Wonkaner lives in a palace which is an amalgam of Italianate columns, Gothic arches, and Mughal pavilions. But its baronial hall, billiard room, and park are no different from those in an English country house. The Maharaja, educated at Clare College, Cambridge, still retains two kitchens. One prepares a traditional Indian lunch, served on silver trays, while the other kitchen presents a four-course English supper. Could you tell us something about the problems of maintaining a palace like this one? Oh, it's very difficult nowadays to maintain a palace like this, with all the problems about the staff and the servant and the maintenance and repairs. How many servants were there previously, say about 30 years ago? Oh, it was, oh, so it was quite different at that time. How many servants would you say there would have been in, in about 30 years ago? Oh, there'll be more servants, more numbers, more and numbers than now. Now how many do you have? Now we got about 10 here in this particular palace, but that's where, not… Where do you get the servants from? Or, no. Are the young people not moving away to the town? We get them locally, but of course they're not the same as before. I noticed last night your dinner was delicious, an English meal. Oh, but they, I, I'm from? glad you think so, but I think you're trying to be up on them. You're uh, being complimentary. Uh, because in, in, in uh, search of uh, employment, they've, most of them have gone out, and that's why it's very difficult. And now people don't want to do domestic work, it seems. Because they've got something else to do and they want to go out and do with probably better prospects, better pay. And uh, they get more freedom there, while in the palace it is uh, more restricted with certain amount of uh, etiquette and uh, protocol. Some of them even don't know how to tie a turban. Since independence, one of the main problems the Maharajas have had to contend with is what role they can play in contemporary India.